my name is Corianne Ledford. And I'm Drew Courtney. And we will be reviewing the nerves of the upper extremity. Today we'll be, we will be starting with the musculocutaneous nerve and the axillary nerves. So the musculocutaneous nerve comes off the lateral cord of the brachial plexus. It leaves the axilla by piercing the coracobrachialis and then descending between the biceps brachii and the brachialis muscle. The motor function of the musculocutaneous nerve is going to be elbow flexion and forearm supination. The sensory function of the musculocutaneous nerve is going to be the lateral aspect of the forearm via the lateral cutaneous nerve. A nice mnemonic to remember the muscles that the musculocutaneous nerve innervates is going to be bodybuilders club, biceps brachii, brachialis, and coracobrachialis. Next, we will be talking about the axillary nerve. So the axillary nerve comes off the posterior cord of the brachial plexus, and it leaves the axilla, the axilla posteriorly through the quadrangular space, coming around laterally and branching into the posterior terminal branch and the anterior terminal branch. The two muscles that are innervated by the axillary nerve are the teres minor and the deltoid. The motor function of the axillary nerve is going to be shoulder abduction and external rotation of the shoulder. A nice mnemonic to remember the nerves that the axillary or the muscles of the axillary nerve innervates is going to be touchdown, T for teres minor, and D for deltoid. The sensory function of the axillary nerve is going to be the lateral aspect of the shoulder via the superior lateral cutaneous nerve. Thanks for watching.